Hey guys, Chris here once again and I'm about to do another deck review. Today we're going to be reviewing the Bicycle Triple X Outlaw 1914 deck. Let's take a look at the box real quick. As you can see from the front, it's a really cool design. Got the guns going off, the old timey outlaw, like badass kind of look on this side. Over here it says US Playing Card Company. Air cushion finish made in USA. Down here the typical legal driving and you see on the back. Let's take a look at the back. The back looks really cool. I really like the way they do this. Um, but you'll see in a moment why uh, it upsets me. Because as you see, uh, when you bring the cards out, yes, it's the same design on the back that the regular cards are. But uh, the border is white. And that's, I don't like that. Especially with like a deck like this. Because um, these cards look like they should have a black back, especially with the background, the border should match the background. That's just my opinion on this thing. Uh, let's take a look at the uh, at the front. The jokers here on this one are very cool as well, and uh, this joker also has a cool little reveal. It says uh, three of diamonds on it. In case you wanted to like do a cool little trick where you reveal the three of diamonds, that's a nice little way to do it. Um, let's see the other bonus cards that they include is, uh, back here. They have a double back card. This time the double back is a mandolin back on the side. The mandolins is a great playing card. I enjoy those cards as well, but, so it's nice to have, a uh, nice to have the red ones pop up there. So you can do a cool color changing effect with that. And then the next one is, a uh, is a blank face card. And you can do a lot of cool stuff with the blank face card, so I'm really glad that they gave them that. But besides that, guys, the cards are basically your standard bicycle card. Um, the, the pips, the faces of the aces, everything, they're all pretty much your standard thing. Oh, except for the ace of spades. Almost forgot about the ace of spades. But even that, the ace of spades is kind of disappointing. This one, it's not very, very different. So, these cards... I like them. Oh, well, uh, let's uh, take a look and see how well they handle. They fan very well. They spread well. They do everything your typical bicycle deck does. Uh, and that's that's the problem, is that it's... That's all it is, is a basic bicycle deck. So, they are cool to look at. They're a nice addition to have to your collection. But it's not something I would... Go out of my way for it to get. If you want to get it, it's very good. I mean, it's a nice thing to add on to the collection. It, I actually feature it on the top row of my deck collection. But it's not one of the must-have decks. And as always, guys, comment, rate, subscribe.